Good day, explorers, and welcome to a short, fun IT class by Master Ogiwo. Today's topic is the hard disk drive parts or the hard disk simple anatomy. All right, I have uh, downloaded uh, this application. Uh, so let's try and see what we have in that magical box. <laughs> it is where we store our information. It can be seen as a simple notebook, right? Uh, so, we have the box here, the green one, and I will try now to place the parts. Uh, this is ID hard disk. This is no, not uh, the modern ones the SSD hard drives, which do not have rotating parts, but the good old and standard hard drive has plates. This is the magnetic plates, which store the information. They are usually one, two, three or more plates. And uh, they rotate. Inside, they rotate uh, in a very fast speed. But now, uh, we need to place the actuator and the other parts uh, which will read the data from the plates. Okay, so we have an actuator and the actuator hand and we should search for heads. There are the read right heads. Right, they are at the edge of the arm. Okay, now, uh, look, if uh, these plates begin to rotate, they will fly away. So, we need to <laughs> uh, fix them in place with a spindle, right, and now they are almost all hard disk drives has debris filters. Uh, this one is maybe here. Right, and finally, I have the uh, jacks, which lead to connecting the hard disk drive into the computer. <laughs> okay, so we have the interface connector, which I don't think is used now. Uh, these days, we can have. 2-3 terabytes of hard disk drives that can be connected with a simple USB. But again, a standard inside drive of uh, a computer should have most of the jacks and things. There is the SATA connector that is used now. Maybe it will become obsolete. And like I said, uh, the I'm the informational and communicational technology applications will remain as historical <laughs> education, <laughs> right? Okay, the power connector, it cannot be mistaken. And the old hard disk drives, they had these uh, jumpers. The jumpers were used to, uh, to say the computer which hard disk is primary and uh, which is secondary they were slave and master hard drives they were again in our days this uh, problem has been fixed now the computer can tell which is the master and the slave drives if he still want to define them <laughs> i don't know how modern operating systems works not that I know how old one worked, but, well, I knew there were old operating systems. This is for today, and thanks for watching.